What's good, man? Come on, let me take y'all down. Let's take y'all down here, man. Marshall Street, this is where it started for me. Shout out to Quan, bro. This is where it started. This nigga stay barefoot, I think. Look, get a picture of Christian Way, man. Lock in, lock in, lock in. It's really where it started, you know. Quan, down here, come down here for the interview, bro. Come down here for the interview. You no, know, but like, this is really where it started type shit. My grandma always lived over there. So I will always see the ball bouncing shit. So I always come down here and poop. So that we... Yeah, type shit. But uh, Lee Street, man, 312. This is where it started. You know, this is where it started, man. This shit really crazy. Started coming out here when I was seven years old. Niggas really didn't let me hoop for real. I used to cry. <laughs> Sit on the curb, you know. Uh, you know. I used to get dropped off. I used to cry hella bad. Ask him. I used to throw Drop. balls at his face, you know what I'm saying? Like that. All this, all types I used to throw balls at people. him. Duck on him. All types of shit, bro. Goddamn. That's how you get better, though, for real. Uh, yeah. Damn, damn. Eventually, niggas just, we got right. Started working more, took this shit a little bit more serious. Football was really my main sport. Football really is my main sport, for real. Let me see that. Football really baseball is. baseball, too, though, right? Yeah, I played when baseball, I too. I was playing baseball. I used to go to uh, baseball practice. Yeah, yeah. Stop by and play basketball. Yeah, bro. I used, to, I used to get it right all the time, bro. Every day, but this is where it started. My grandma and friend lived down there, so I was always out this bitch, bro. Like, so I used to eat up niggas' popsicles and shit, just sit down. I still do that shit. But, uh, this not the original room. The original room was black, bro. And it was beat, bro. I swear to God, that shit was beat. It was beat. I think we had a wooden, we had a wooden shit, too. And then, yeah, bro, if a ball can go through, we hoop on it. Yeah, we hoop on it. Goddamn, we had a wooden rim with a bent. I mean, we had a wooden bat boy with a bent rim, a black goal. It was all black with a small ass bat boy, and the rim like it went up like that. Uh, the the one before that we had an NBA goal. That shit was nice, but like we started to try to dunk a lot. Like we got like we started wanting to dunk more and shit. This one been through. Like, yeah, this one been through hell, bro. Broke the rim off of this one, put it back been, on. Yeah. Niggas got down just. Niggas got down breaking shit, bro. But yeah, every day, hey, most, three most memorable things out here. One time me and Quan, we was 1v1ing. This nigga Quan went like this, he lost the ball, kicked it, threw it in the rim while jumping over the water. It's always water right here, bro. That shit is crazy. It's always water out of this motherfucker. That shit is crazy. <laughs> Second memorable thing, we was out here. Quan kept locking me up the day before. It was nighttime in the winter. I never forget this. I was, bro, PG was my favorite player at the time. I came out here it was like this. I came like this. I said, <clears throat> shot it like that, cast in his face for game. You remember it was, that? It was nighttime. Too. It was nighttime. I was giving it, it was like from out here too. I was getting that nigga bucket. And I threw it up because I was scared he was gonna block it. I swear to God. What's the third? Third most memorable thing ever to fucking no, actually I got four. The third one. It was fucking crazy. This nigga was locking me up all game. He was talking shit. I never got, I called him a bitch right here. I said, uh, 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 uh. He went like this. He was like, uh, uh. And he got back up. I nah, remember I missed the shot. Like he lying, bro. Nah, I'm not. Yeah, Malik, you was out here. Malik, you, <laughs> Malik, you was out here. No. That's what right. you did right there. All right, I got five yeah, memorable things. Right Top five. Number four, it used to be this girl that stayed here. One day, I used to like me real bad. But her sister had a fat ass, so I always tried to fuck with her sister. And uh, she got bricks, and like, she tried, to throw bricks. She, she tried to throw bricks at me and shit. Never forget, I was like, nah, that's how I knew bitches was toxic at a young age. Anyway, though, fifth fucking thing, scariest day of my life out here. The dog. Man. Yes, the dog. What Yo, I, I jumped over the trash can. I went all the way over there, like, towards Cooper's Point and shit, towards the school. Nigga, I don't even know where he went, bro. We was out. It was this fat bitch. She fell, bro. That shit had me reach, bro. Hey, nah, bro. I don't know. I was gone, bro. Yeah, I know you see me going at that house. Yeah, but it didn't give out kool aid I never get it. And then okay. my 16, dude thought old buddy lost. It was that like they was cousins. Dude thought old buddy lost his wallet. <laughs> they was about to scrap, bro. Mm -hmm. That shit had me weak, bro. That shit had me weak, bro. That joint had me weak. Oh, when Tommy. They found that wheels and Tommy was mad, man. That shit had me weak, bro. Can't lie. And then shout out to Nudie, bro. Nudie, you don't stay out here no more. Nudie used to be out here a lot, bro. Nudie was funny as shit, bro. 
Yeah. Nitty girl got mad and tried to, I don't think he was out here. He got, she got mad and tried to hit him with a car. He dropped a blit out his pants. He dropped a blit out his shorts, bro. That shit fell out his shorts, bro. Yeah. His whole fucking mag fell out of gun, bro, nigga. I ain't never seen a nigga break a gun. Shout out to Nudio. Nudio broke the blit. But uh, yeah, I used to rage and shit. I used to punch the dead end sign, yeah, kick trash cans. That shit is crazy. One time I made a bucket, got so happy I went swimming in the pool. I mean, this shit right here. L day, man. L day. L skincare, bro. L skincare. Let, let's hear some words from Malik, bro. What the hell is that? Some great, bro? <laughs> Alright, well, first, let's listen to some words from Khan. Quan, because he really seen me grow over the years. Alright, bro. So, what you guys say about me, bro? Like, over the years, what you, what you seen? I just remember me, you know what I'm saying, meeting you all the time. And then like summers we working together, you know what I'm saying? Seeing you get better. Yo, he we used me. to work out with trash cans. Yeah, yeah. Dead ass. Yeah. He helped me get my first dunk, so like we just help each other, but to the hooper he became now, like I never like seen that. You know what I'm saying? Cause he used to play like different sports. But he just stuck the basketball. And, yeah. And he still wanna duck on me. So like yeah. Come on, I can't jump. He's scared. I got, you could duck on me probably now. I'm not going to lie. Before the camera got on, he was scared to play meeting me at the room. Malik, what you got to say, bro? Nigga, I'll catch you, nigga. You got to catch me. That's what I say about me from over the years, bro. I mean, basically what he said. Same thing, like. All right, what, what's I mean, some crazy-ass growth, like. I mean, that's all it takes, though, when you just work, bro. You just keep working. You just get better over time. That's, that's what it's all about. Like, this. Hey. Like, like, basically everything you was explaining, bro, that's, that's, that's. It led to this right here. That's hey, look, bro. Cra your crazy, top three memories for me. Come on, go first. Like, your cra like crazy shit I've done out here. Bro, this, bro, this dude was jumping over us, bro. <laughs> like, I was sitting yeah. around, but this dude done women over me, bro. Like, I had to get like that. This nigga women over me. We got it on video. Jay oh, yeah, got it on yeah, his yeah, phone. Yeah, yeah, he done over all of us. And one time he just came out here and put out a windmill, bro. Like, one hand, though. That was like, like one hand windmill. All right, what's your number two? Dude, shit. Uh, bro, this dude freaking dunk and break no. This nigga dunk the goal down, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah. I broke the rim. <laughs> this nigga, we was like, bro, oh, shoot. We had to catch the goal. I don't know if it fell or we caught it, but this dude. Nah, y'all caught that it. Bit. Man caught it. I did it before you, though. Yeah, you did. What's your, all right, what's your third one? Like, your best one? Nah, the dunk, the jumping over shit was crazy. Probably when... Something crazy there. Oh, yeah. It's like so much shit though. All right. I've been on years for real. I remember you done. <laughs> you think you done on him? Yeah, I done on Elite. He's on like, your head. On your head. I mean, I don't count it as that, but. That was a dunk on I, I mean, me man, personally, I only got head <laughs> Oh, God, cool. I done on him. All right, yeah. what's your top three? Start with number one. Uh, probably, probably what you said for real. Jump it over? Yeah, hell yeah. Top two? Yeah. That. Uh, I was about to say when you cook that old head. <laughs> cook that old head, nigga. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was funny as hell. the tall one? That nigga. I was yeah, dunked on him. What's up? That nigga was like, that man was talking crazy. I'm talking like, this nigga was talking Wait, crazy. Wait, when? He was talking back to that nigga. That, that nigga, that, the nigga that was finna fight that nigga. Oh, yeah. His wallet yeah. type stuff. Yeah. That nigga, you and that nigga said dumb. Nah, I mean, when Jalen, you push that dude and Dre's down, he said, bro. Alright, bro. Oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Pushing, oh yeah, that too. Like, bro, he's like, yeah, that too. I don't get for real. Now he punched punch the pole. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> that too. Though. You got him tight, bro. Man, nah, cause I was lucky cooking his ass, bro. Yeah, no I was cooking his ass, bro. This bitch and niggas off. Well, all right. What's your what's your three, Malik? Them. That's it. I mean, that's it. That basically. Ashy, like yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. That probably uh, yeah. We could cut a lot of niggas out here, so. <laughs> What's your most memorable cook? The old head. I mean, yeah, that nigga was getting cooked, but I'm trying to figure yeah, out. I mean, we, he broke this dude's ankle, bro. He did like the. Who? <laughs> oh, like Nick, Mario, brother. Bro. That's Nick. all I did with somebody. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of angles got took on the court. All right. Dunk on. All right, look, look, hold the camera, hold the camera, hold the camera. Never forget, bro. It, they got a. We got this cousin. I call him we because like we like family as motherfuckers. But this nigga named Zalin. Cause I only think he could whoop anybody ass. <laughs> oh, so we went over here. We was boxing. Put the camera over there. We was boxing. I dropped his ass. I dropped him, bro. I never get. I dropped him. He got up. He was like, oh shit. <laughs> I never forget that. That shit is crazy.
Oh, yeah. Like, bro, but really? Alright, y'all, yeah, but ask me some questions. Fat cat, bro. <laughs> <laughs> fat cat. Bro, no. he could make it anywhere yeah. from over there, bro. Hell, this nigga is right. This nigga was like, this nigga was like, right? this nigga was like, <laughs> this nigga was like, this nigga was like, back here with man, man. How have you seen me change over the years? I'm like, who I was to who I am now. Yeah. But, you talking about how, like, how good you got? Yeah. Like, you proved? Yeah. You improved a lot, really. What's the biggest thing like in my game that improved? Handles. Defense got crazy. Bounce. Dude. Bounce. Yeah, bounce. bounce. Crazy yeah. thing you see me do out here. All right, with me. Right. Off one, like this, yeah, or yeah, over. Yeah. Over there. Over there. Yeah. All right, one. That's what Quan was saying. Yeah, that's what Quan said. I'm about to say, right. you can't say the other because he was. That's important. All right, when basketball started with me, it was. It was late for real, wasn't it? It was late as fuck, bro. It was late. That look, Aunt Joyce. I said shout out to her earlier. She always kept basketball in me, for real. Always. She always wanted me to hoop. That's her favorite thing. I was sitting there watching the games with her as a kid, bro. Just watch games. I watched Kyrie Irving. The one season he played. I play. I watched them play against UNC, cause that's her team, UNC. So I watched a lot of players play against him and stuff. You know, Caleb Love, Dayron. I watched a lot of players, man. So, but it all started. What made you get into basketball? So, to be honest, bro. Like, to be honest, I didn't start playing organized sports like my great grandma dog. That shit crazy. Chill. I'm not smiling. Chill. That shit crazy. My you grandma. Man, bro. No, I got you, man. You for real. All right. <laughs> my grandma died, bro. And like, I ain't do nothing. She always wanted me to do something, bro. Like, she was already do something type of person, bro. Like, just get out here and do something. And I ain't never really want to do nothing for real. I just want to sit in the house and eat Twinkies and shit. <laughs> so, lines, bro. I'm bro. dead ass. I always want to eat. Oh, so you, that's how you was thinking, like, while doing sports, you just didn't want to do it. Yeah, I never played organized sports until she passed away. And How old was you? She was like fourth grade. Oh. It was mad late, bro. Oh, yeah. And uh, Tabai, my homeboy, he's Tobias. nice. Tabai is nice, bro. He used to go to my elementary school. He's a grade up from me. And uh, he used to be real nice. Like, he was nationally ranked fifth grader, stuff like that. He was real nice. And, uh, man, just. I always like I see him play. He always had me on the playground and stuff. We always be playing and joint, just joking around. He used to fry me and stuff like that. But yeah, I always, I always, stomach grounds are here though. There's really I had nothing to do, had nothing to do when we got out of school, so I would just come over here and watch. He was never good in basketball. From when I met him, he was like he used to play baseball. I'm the I, I'm the, like got him like good a little bit because like I'm here to like teach him that like it's not gonna be easy and stuff like that and I feel like that one of, that made him want to get better because every time he come over here I beat him type stuff like that. Yeah, so like what him. what I feel like you got better you got like good like this good like seventh grade bro sixth grade you wasn't all that because I seventh watched grade you. was seventh grade seventh and grade. grade bro you got good. Seventh grade was my first time on the school team yeah. and my first year playing AAU. Uh, shout out to Dilla Hunt, bro. I don't care what y'all say about him. Baby T, stop smacking that nigga head, bro. Uh, but shout out to Dilla Hunt. Bro, Dilla Hunt, I used to, he just worked with me, bro. Like, Dilla Hunt, him and Dilla Hunt always seen it, bro. I used, I, I never seen it. I used to go home and cry because he used to work me out so much, and I never seen it. Like, I never thought. Like, I'm not even at my best yet. This is just the beginning, like, for real. It's just the beginning. Like, I'm just now catching bodies and stuff. That like, is really just the beginning. Like, some crazy stuff here. But yeah. You gotta wrap it up. Yeah. Shout out to Coach Keith. Dungeon. Yeah. yeah, shout out all of them. In the dungeon. Shout out my mom. Shout out all of them, you know. It's been one of a, it's been a crazy experience. Lots of up and downs, lots of injuries and stuff. Cause I, I can't stay from getting hurt. You know, big shout out to Jalen, uh, Quan. Ezra, shout out to the Meachums. Yeah. That shit, it's been lit, man. Where I wanna go? 
You want to know what uh, North, North Carolina, right? Yeah, North Carolina. North Carolina. Or HBCU, like Central for A&T. Oh, what's, 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 what's that? A&T. A&T Aggies, nigga. Buckets. And then what Bronny say? If you know, you know. So you know, you know. I guess you don't know. On his head. Ain't that what they do? Ain't that what they do? <laughs> but who, yeah. Who you like? Who, like what? Who you looking like to uh, go against? Who I'm looking at? You know what I mean, like previous rivals or something like that. Uh, you like know, a friendly rival. Keyshawn Hearing, number one eighth grader, going into high school. I was number two. Uh, it's all love when it comes between us, you know. But he going to Kingston, I'm going to South. So I, I want to see that matchup for sure. That's something I want to see for sure. That's something I want to be a part of. And uh, anybody that go to Conley could fuck Conley. Falcons around here smoking on that Conley pack. You feel me? So anybody, my homeboy is going to Conley. Gavin, fuck you, nigga. I'm coming for you. On his head, you feel me? And you gonna catch your body? You're like, oh yeah, for sure. School, bro. For sure, for sure that we're we're there. Bodies after bodies. Yeah, I'm gonna catch a body. Yeah, for sure. I guarantee. You ain't even get that championship right. Yeah, yeah. If I don't get it, I'm gonna at least get there. You feel me? I'm gonna at least get there. But yeah. I think you're gonna start as a freshman on like on varsity? On varsity? You can do it. I mean, I could do it. It just it's really about decision making. I know I got the athletics. It's about who fit, like doing the team like. Yeah, it's all about decision making. For me, it's about the decisions I make on the court. Like everything's not a highlight play. I gotta make the right pass. Run the right play, shit like that. Everything is not a highlight, not a go up and get it type, type ordeal. You feel me? So yeah, it's, it's all about, all about what I could do, what decisions I make on the court. Yeah. So. Well, what the hell, boy? You selfie now? You threw it off the backboard, but you touched it in, bro. You could do that. What you got? I'm at a nigga ain't guard me. Let me tell y'all a secret. Go on, so. Slight word. 60. Let's talk about my lead. Predictions right now. Let me see. What's your predictions? I don't know. I mean, he coming back a little bit. Well, you, I mean, you almost got game, so. I do got game. You in the position to just finish it, but. It's up hey, hey, what hey, what should I do for the finish? Should I, I like East Bay and I like put it on his head? Weird, bro. Weird, bro. Talking about his head. Weird, what he say? Don't go a game with him. I bet. He talk, what he say, bro? Don't go for game with him. He trying to say, uh, <laughs> bro, I will, bro, I will. Bro, I will come around, bro. Stop playing. 
<laughs> You're not like that. Stop fouling. He's mean nigga. Okay. Stop fouling. Hey, little nigga fouling. <laughs> you ain't got no handles, boy. Shut up. Shut up. Make sure you shut up. Hey, Adam. Big shit, you want to foul? Say that. Say that. You want to foul? Say that. Say that. Get off my body. Say that, bro. Why y'all going to do your body? Say that. Get off me. Why you going to do your body? Say that. Get off me. Huh? Get off me. Hey, 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 get off you know, this is a real, right? Yeah, hot sauce, nigga. What's up, bro? So far, with the rain, you see the sun, sun rays through there. It's so far. Hey, what y'all want to see real quick? Windmill. East Bay. East Bay. Oh Hey. 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 Hey.